exciting. If Leonard and Penny get back together, Howard and I can go on double dates with them. How come you never invite Sheldon and me on a double date? Too much? Yeah. No. <laughs> okay, just hang on. You just can't handle her raw sexuality, can you? When did you and Leonard break up? Uh, about two years ago. Why do you think he asked you out again? I don't know. Maybe he's dying. That would be so romantic. <laughs> he's not dying. Too bad. <laughs> If he were, she could just throw him in bed and ride him right up until he flatlines. How about this? Maybe. Come on. <laughs> yeah, okay, no. Do you think you'll sleep with him tonight? Absolutely not. Look, we're just gonna have dinner and, you know, see how it goes. If he were dying, would you sleep with him? <laughs> what? Assuming he were dying of something that couldn't be sexually transmitted. You know, like a spear wound to the head? Okay, he is not dying. How do you know? Are you a doctor? You can make believe, though. Sometimes Howard and I pretend that his arrhythmia is acting up and I'm a sexy cardiologist. And the naughty part is I'm not in his HMO network. Screw it. I'm not going to make a big deal out of this. It's just dinner. With a dead man. <laughs> Amy, stop it. Oh, God, I'm so nervous. Relax. You know Leonard's always been crazy about you. It's going to be great. I know. We've finally gotten to a place where we can hang out without it being weird. And if something goes wrong, then what? Guess it'll just be Sheldon and me going on a double date with Howard and Bernadette. <laughs> sure. We'd love that. Change of clothes. We got a lot riding on this. <laughs>